Hey Scorpio, I hope you all are doing well. This is going to be our ge a general reading for your next 50 days. Any information you need, you can find it in the description box. I do have personals open. I have a March special going on for a limited time if you guys want to check that out. Uh, details on that are located down below as well. So we're going to start here for you Scorpio. We have that one poking out so let me see what it is. Knight of Cups. Mm -hmm. Five of Swords. Four swords. So something starts to move backwards here, I feel. It's like chaos, conflict, back to balance. Chaos, conflict, back to balance is kind of how this feels here. But you never quite moved to that six of swords is, is how this is looking to me. You had the five and then you have the four. So it's like there's there's fighting, then there's truce, there's fighting, then there's truce. This could be past energy for some of you because you do have the knight of cups here, which can be an apology. Let's look at that. We got Pisces energy with the knight of cups. We got the Six of Cups, Sun in Scorpio, goodness. Page of Pentacles, Earth, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and one more here for this, the Hierophant, Taurus Energy. There is an apology coming in here, I mean, but I, I feel like you're involved, okay? I feel like you're involved. Page of Pentacles, the Hierophant. I mean, Page of Pentacles sets the trend for long-term stability. I feel like there's someone brand new here that you're... Obviously, I feel like you're on the path to having a really solid long-term commitment with this individual, but then you have the past wanting to give you something, okay? Wanting to start something up, okay? Wanting to, can we be friends? Can we do this? Can we do that? You know, can you hang out? You're like, I have a person. They're like, you can't have friends. That's the kind of person that you're dealing with here. You have the Five of Swords, but this is someone from your past. They've already had their chance here. What's going on with the Five of Swords here for Scorpio? The Hermit, Virgo Energy. They're like, I've done work on myself. Shh, don't. Don't do this. Strength, Leo Energy, and the Empress, Taurus, and Libra. Yeah, I mean, Five of Swords is someone who will win at all costs. And you have three majors here. It's like this person is super, super problematic. It's almost as if they're only trying to start something back up here because you have someone else. You know, it's not even that they've genuinely done work and they see what they've missed out on. It's that they want to see if they still have that power and control with the Strength card showing up here. They're trying to see if they still have that grip on you. Okay, Empress, Empress is showing up here. Um, I feel like you've done a lot of work on yourself. I almost feel like I don't even have to tell you not to do it, but you know, I feel like you do want to have some kind of truce here. You don't want that energy hanging over your head. Like you don't want that to be a thing, okay? So let's look at that Four of Swords. Ooh, let me move. Oh God, I have a cramp in my leg. And I've got my baby in my lap. Oh God, whew. All right. Um, so yeah, I mean, you moved to the Four of Swords, so it's like, yeah, I feel like you went back and forth with this person. You tried it with this person. Things were super toxic. I feel like it was, you know, fighting, arguing, apologizing, promising changes, and then back to normal, you know? Um, so yeah, I mean, I feel like you've grown a lot from that, and since this has happened, you have the Four of Swords here. You do want a truce. Like I said, I think that you have some good memories with this person, and you don't want them to... You know, you don't want to have some kind of um, bad ending, basically. You don't want to end on bad terms, but... You know, by not ending on bad terms, this person feels as if you're you're not done for good for whatever reason. Like they they can't they can't accept that you can end something on good terms and not have a desire to be involved with them again. So that's a problem, and then it's and it's going to be a problem for you and for a person that you're involved with here. Um, yeah, I mean, Four of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, they're not going to let it go. They're not going to let it go. So I feel like that's going to become a problem in the next 50 days. Could be a Capricorn. I've got it showing up twice. Or a Sagittarius, possibly with the Temperance card. Um, some of you, it's going to be an air sign with those uh, signs in their chart here. Let me see what else we've got going on for this. They want a resolution, but if they have a resolution, they're not going to be able to let go of it. Yeah, you know, I think that you can wish them the best here. But continuing to, you know, keep contact with them, that's where things are going to get sticky and messy. However, with this new individual, if you are to send this away, this new individual is going to know that you're serious, okay? Because they know, like you've expressed how much heartbreak this person has put you through. And if you are to send them away, this person's going to know with the emperor that you are serious. Like you want to actually commit to this connection here. So things could start moving a lot faster than you had expected it to with this new individual here, Scorpio. Like I said, I think you're on the path to a really solid commitment with this person, something long term. Um, this could be somebody that maybe you go on to have children with or you live with. Or for those of you who want it, this could be someone 
you marry, okay? Um, it could definitely be an Aries. It could be 444 on the camera. It could be a Virgo, but um, this person, they're going to see when you send this individual away because they know how hard it was for you to get over that person. They're going to see when you send them away that, you know, you are serious about them and you're willing to commit. Um, so yeah, I think things could start moving a lot faster than you had originally thought uh, that they would with this new individual. So um, I like that for you, Scorpio. Uh, it looks a little bit, you know, hectic, but it is what it is. That's life. Um, so details are down below for anyone who may be interested in personals. But if this is where we part, thank you all so much for watching and supporting me this far. I really appreciate you and I hope I'll see you next time. Bye.